For the second time in just over a month, a fire breaks out inside a limousine packed with women. They made it out safely this time, but now many are wondering how could it happen again? Good morning. I'm Eric Thomas. Cheryl Jennings and Kristen Z are off today. That's one of the questions for Walnut Creek police who are investigating the fire. And now they're alerting the CHP who still have an open investigation into a fatal limo fire on the San Mateo Bridge. More now from ABC 7 News reporter Amy Hollyfield live in Rossmore. Amy? And what happened here in Rossmore was terrifying for the women, Eric. But police point out to me it was a vehicle fire with no injuries. It happened on private property. And they say at this point there's no indication that a crime was committed. Here is a shot of that limo right after the fire. It was carrying 10 women. Most of them are in their 90s. They also had some caretakers with them. They were on their way to a birthday party in Sonoma. Right here in Rossmore, though, before they left the development, this this development here, they smelled smoke. Smoke. They got out safely. Police think the fact that there had been a limo fire last month on the San Mateo Bridge played a role in their quick thinking and why uh, they also think that's why this limo fire that happened here yesterday is getting attention. I, I think it's highly unusual. Um, I had that San Mateo Bridge fire not occurred, I don't think you'd be here interviewing me today. And because of that, uh, because that that was on the minds of the people that were in the limo. I think that's what caused them to be so alert about the smell of smoke and the dangers, and that's why they got out of the limo. Um, there is no crime at this point. Like I said, we're happy that everybody escaped uninjured, and if something turns up that shows any sort of negligence or anything, then, then we'll look into it further, but at this point, there's nothing to indicate that. Last month, five women died when the limo they were riding in caught fire on the San Mateo Bridge. Four other women and the driver inside that limo did escape. That group of women was on their way to a bridal shower. The bride was one of the five who died. That fire was horrific. It was stunning. It made national news. And Walnut Creek police say the one that happened yesterday is getting attention because of the similarities. But at this point, they don't have plans to inspect the limo from yesterday. It was towed away by a private company. And again, they don't think any crime was committed. Now, I did speak with the Public Utilities Commission. They are looking into it. They're going to make sure that the driver and the company was in good standing. They're working on that right now. So we're hoping to get more answers from them later today. The owner of Town Car SF is calling this a manufacturing defect. He says he takes good care of his cars. Reporting live in Rossmore, Amy Hollyfield, ABC 7 News.